Hello, subscribers. Welcome to a live stream of AD&D's Pool of Radiance. So this is my no caster playthrough, and this is part three. And I believe I, my last save game was B, but I better check on that. You know, I was by the Bane Temple. Yeah, it looks like B was my last save game. Okay. So let's get going here. Looks like I'm injured. Can cast some cures here. Durton is an NPC. So. I'm only going to have him for a short period of time until he decides to leave us. Okay, I think I already went in that building. Stand outside a large mansion. Hey, says Tam. Welcome. How are you doing? Here we got this really long name weapon. Two-handed sword plus one plus three verse and dead. <laughs> it takes up a lot of characters. And we're going to try to shoot this guy down. Because the orc leaders are ranged. Fine composite longbow, that should do it. You doing good? Glad to hear it. Yeah, I'm doing well. Okay, let's see if we can shoot him down now. Oh. And I can't wait to get fine composite longbows for all of my characters. That's going to be crazy good. Sandstam so says, in Menzo Berezin, some of the spell and item names are larger than the fields that hold them. <laughs> That's funny. Hey, Bo, welcome to stream. How are you doing today? I am doing well. Thanks for asking. We're going to see if we can take on the Temple of Bane. Okay, so we'll take this. Item-wise, that all looks like normal stuff. So I'm not going to take that. Okay. I guess I'll turn on search. We surprised some orcs. So if we wait, they'll probably run. Oh, both sides wait. <laughs> okay, combat. We get some free attacks. Whoa, that's a lot of orcs. What? You're doing great. Glad to hear that, Bo. You've been working on your next video, huh? One where you're going to review all those. Nice. Taking down a lot of orcs here. Yeah, 
He gets spiritual hammer. <laughs> Why? Bo says, yeah, that one is going to take a while to film. Need to make sure I can get the same game on each handheld. And I have a lot of handhelds. <laughs> nice. Oh, I will keep my eye out for it, that's for sure. Silver, it's not worth picking up. Okay. Uh, that's where I came from, wasn't it? Yeah. You enter a room that's been converted into a cell. On the wall here is a poorly scratched out message. You can barely make out the words. North wall, right front glass. Okay. Yeah, I think that's the secret room in the temple that they're talking about. Crude bed, search. As you search the beds, a group of orcs come into the room. Okay. Yeah, I wonder how many people would ever not search. Like, you're prompted with an option. Do you want to search? No, no, I'm not going to search. <laughs> I mean, who would do that? There's a diamond on the floor. Do you want to pick it up? No, I'm not going to pick it up. Eighteen experience. Oh boy. You finish searching the beds, but you find nothing but lice and hair. Oh boy, that's wonderful. Spot a group of hobgoblins. Parlay. We're gonna be abusive. We got to keep all you non-believers out of here. <laughs> the monsters say as they begin to leave. So hit the road, you bums. Monsters turn and leave. Bo says, maybe if Jeff Bezos was in the game, those jewels are nothing to him. <laughs> Test him says, I'm so encumbered with treasure, I don't even want to think of more wealth. <laughs> Yeah, that's true. That that does happen in this game, except when you're trying to save up for fine longbows like I am. Okay, so we're done with that. Twenty-five thousand gold each. I wonder if I can rest in any of these places. Probably not. You see a group of four orcs who shield bear a black hand on a red field. They cautiously look you over. Parlay, abusive. Abusive works well against orcs. Bo says, I mean, this game has a broken economy. It really does. All the gold box games do. But, you know what, to be honest, it may not really be that broken for this party setup that I have. 
trying to buy six fine longbows, 25,000 gold. I may actually need to collect all the drunk treasure I can to be able to achieve that. Normally you can't do that because you won't have that many fighters. But for this setup, I definitely need something like that. been in here yeah I wonder if I can rest in here let me try it nope suddenly attack fight works is that it just orcs yep okay Bo says, remember, or true, I remember playing Final Fantasy 1 with an all-fighter party. It was so expensive to buy gear. Yeah. It's kind of the same thing in the Bard's Tale when I was doing that one run-through where I didn't have casters. I needed all the money I could get because I had to pay the temple to heal me, you know, until I eventually found a staff of lore. So I needed 100,000 plus gold pieces so there were you know kind of rare but there are situations where you do need it man we're sticking these down left and right okay well we can't rest here so i guess we'll just have to go for it that going here yet? I don't think I did. I could go back to Flam, but I think if I do dirt and I'll leave. So I don't want to do that. Surprised by works. E. Oh man, and there's a bunch of them. Is pretty pretty dumb it spends a lot of time walking back and forth Okay, now we can use our fine closet longbow. Wow, missed with both arrows. Curtain's gonna go down. I'm gonna have to move someone closer. I distract a bit. He went down anyway. Okay, well, that answers that. I'll be going back to uh, Flan then. You know what? He may not leave the party if he's unconscious when I arrive. That'll be interesting. I don't think I ever tried that.
Okay, they're surrendering. Get out of here. Go back to Flan. Parlay, abusive. Ah, another one. Seems to always work. Okay. We're going to go boat? Yeah, boat. There we go. It looks like Durton didn't leave us. To rest for ages. Buy some more arrows, silver arrows while I'm here. And we'll see if anybody's do level up. I doubt it. I really haven't got much experience at all going there. Okay, uh, it's nighttime. Oh. Alright, we can identify. If we find anything good. Let's see what this potion is. Ooh, nice. Potion of extra healing. I really need that for this party. Let's... These I can't use, so I might as well sell them. I think those are restoration scrolls. Okay. Think any of that's magical now? Winner, what is this ring? Ah, oh, it's a ring of feather falling. Does that even have a use in this game? I don't think I ever figured out if that has a use. Huh. I don't know if there's <clears throat> any pits that are traps that that would save us from. Wow, that scroll's worth a lot. I'm going to hang on to it until I'm ready to sell. Alright. I think I might buy him plate now. He doesn't need much movement. Okay. Let's see. How are we doing? Platinum-wise, we look pretty good. Uh, gosh, I'm kind of wanting to appraise this and sell it. I might be able to get up to 25,000. Let's see. Right now I have roughly 3,500 gold. I need 25,000. Yeah, I don't think I'll get it with nine jewelry. Sometimes you find a piece of jewelry that's worth like 8,000, but it's not the norm. Uh, 
All right, let's see if anyone's do a level up. So what do I need to get to level five as a fighter? 18,000. So we're getting there. What about Trixie? 6,600 she has. I think I need 8,000 maybe for level four fighter. Yeah, 8,001. She's always off. 18,000. Yep, yeah, so nobody's ready. All right, then we'll go ahead and do a share. Let's pick up some more silver arrows. So how many do you have? 96. 88, you can do a few. Juggernaut, 94. Uh, let's see, Dirk, 94. Winner definitely needs more. 152, but he's using the fine longbow. Two fifty two, nice. And Trixie, you shoot a bow pretty often too. Let's get you a punch. Perfect. That's really weird. I just realized you can get twenty silver arrows for twenty. But to get a silver coral, you only get one silver coral for 20. What's up with that? Huh. Okay, we're ready to go back again. Hey there, Rage. Welcome to this stream. How are you doing? It's the first time you ever see a ring of feather fall in these games. Yeah, me too. I don't think I've ever... I think maybe I've seen it once before, and I couldn't figure out where in the world to use it. Like, I don't know if it has a real effect. I think it's a randomly generated item, and it's pretty rare. Okay, let's see here. We're going to go south. And then we're, I think, over this direction is the Temple of Bang. Yeah, there we go. So it said we need a, a black unholy symbol to get in. I'm not entirely sure that's accurate. I think I might be able to use this wooden holy symbol. We'll see when we get closer. I don't think any of these rooms have anything like that. Bo says, what would it even be used for here? Yeah, the only thing I can think of is if there's a pit, maybe you can fall in. And it would protect you from the damage of falling. I don't know. It seems pretty useless. And Rage says, I don't recall taking falling damage in these games ever. Yeah, I don't remember either. Yeah, I just... Just don't know. Maybe they intended for it to have a purpose and they never implemented it. Group of orcs. Gonna parlay and be abusive again. 
Kudos well without a thief, Rage says. Maybe. But, but I mean, <laughs> it's kind of silly because, you know, you can just rest if you fall. Yeah, we'll just go up to the front doors here. I will equip the wood and holy symbol first. Because I don't know if it has to be equipped, and I don't even know if this works. I don't remember. It's been a while. What? Look at that. What is that up there? There's a glitch in the graphics. Look at that background. Got right above that wall, it's got like a little thing there. But we're at the edge of the map. And there, it doesn't exist. Never noticed that before. Oh, surprise bike. Oh my good. What? So, who said that based on your attributes, you fight more enemies? I'm calling BS on that. Because look at this. That my randomly, poorly randomly generated party is fighting a whole army of goblins right now. So, <laughs> I don't think that's true. Hey, Gabriel, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Bo says a bloody sky. And Gabriel says a glitch or an Easter egg? Good, good question. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, look at this. It's it's like Sokol Keep of goblins. <laughs> at least I can sweep them. That's going to help. <laughs> yeah, we're going down the goblin town. Oh, man. I gotta kill those leaders back there. <laughs> Gabriel says, oh hey, here's an army by the way, enjoy. <laughs> we can sweep four at a time. At least with almost all my characters because they're level four. Gabriel says they just came to receive you, but you keep attacking and killing them as soon as they come close. <laughs> okay, let's equip our bow here. I'll try to shoot down the leaders in the back. Oh, I so wish I had fireball right now. <laughs> What made this even worse is they surprised me. How can this gigantic army surprise me? That's what I want to know. What's that noise that I hear outside the door? It sounds like a hundred goblins walk around. Oh no, that's just uh, the wind. <laughs> it's like, what the heck? <laughs> Gabriel says apparently this is a no caster and no senses whatsoever run <laughs> it's a, a deafened party run Okay, finally, you can equip the fine deposit longbow. Shoot down some of these darn leaders.
<laughs> oh, the AI was moving. Up. It's like, no, I moved two squares. I don't think I can reach you, so I'm just gonna stop. <laughs> I love when they run behind walls like that. Oh, are they over here? Oh, no, it's just, nobody over here. Gabriel says, man, what a crap army you must have not to be able to take on six dudes. <laughs> surrendering good I'll keep sweeping them until they all surrender And 17 experience. Tons of silver that I'm not going to carry. Arrows. Uh, I think that all looks normal. I don't see anything magical. Gotta pick that up. Man, I'm so injured now. Gosh. I don't think I could go into Bane right now. I'm going to have to go back. I wish there was a safe place to rest. Oh, ogres this time. Oh my goodness. I think after the first 10 guys or so, they'll even scratch the six guys. The army just realize there are better hills to die on. You would think. Back to flan, back to rest. With casters, you can usually get away with resting. Like just a few hours, you know, just enough to get your spell your spells memorized again. But at this party, you have to rest a full day for a single hit point. There's no way I can rest anywhere unless it's completely safe. Going to do the boat. Uh, that's not what I wanted. We're gonna do south. We're 
worth is, I think, the graveyard, which definitely not ready for that. Okay, Durden, do you still have the wooden holy symbol? Yes. Old blind decrepit orc stands outside with eight orcs as you approach the move, allowing you entrance. Okay, so that worked. The wooden holy symbol that Durden had allowed me to get in here. Now, I'm going to search because I know there's hidden treasure around there somewhere. I think sometimes you have to walk on the tiles multiple times, too, if I remember right. But maybe it won't show up until I kill the bad guys. I don't know. That might be how it works. Let me leave it for now and let me search. Yeah, okay. So I want to do this before I destroy it because I think if I destroy the temple first, I may get more random encounters afterwards. Ooh, nice. We're finally getting some weapons, magic weapons that we can have on this party. Awesome. I'm going to keep walking back and forth on each line for a while. Hey, Cody, welcome to the stream. How you doing? Because, like I said, sometimes you have to do multiple passes. He says, I really want somebody to make a new engine for these gold gold box games. I think the UI is the biggest hurdle for me. And Bo says, oh yeah, if they remastered them, it would be amazing. To me, quality of life improvements are, are more important than graphics. I think the graphics are fine for an old game, but they had um, kind of like an auto mapper like they did in the Bard Steel Trilogy. That would be amazing. And uh, just some quality of life improvements. Ooh, nice. I hope this is a wand of magic missiles. Because fighters can use those. Okay, let's see. Winner, he's the, he's my strong guy. Woods, holy symbol. Not wooden, but woods. He can carry seven gold statuettes. I think he can equip this. Let's see. Yes, that's probably a wand of magic missiles. Could be a wand of lightning too, but I'll actually give it to Trixie. She's my weaker one. Gabriel says, "Oh yeah, we have all the pixels we need here, all twenty of them." <laughs> and Cody says, "Remaster would be cool, but I'd be satisfied with a fan-made tool." present the original assets um yeah cody actually they have something called unlimited ventures do you know about that i have a review on it and it allows you to it's vga graphics and it allows you to make gold box games okay so you already know about unlimited ventures I have a review of that for anybody watching that doesn't know what that is. I'm sure there's no hidden trap here. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Already did that one. That one. I did this one too. Yeah. This place is like a gold mine.
not so much to make them as just recreate a modern engine that takes advantage of the original assets. What he says. Here we go, trap door. Nice. Scrolls, okay. So Trixie can use magic user scrolls. Uh oh. The minute you find the treasure, a large group of orcs charge through the temple doors. Kill them! Oh! They're. Wow, and they get to surprise me? That's not good. Oh, okay, good. I'm not surprised. They just went first. Let me take a look here. They go at 15. Let's see if any of these are better. That's a plus one. Plus one. Plus one. Plus one. So four, all these are just plus one weapons. Spears two-handed. Yeah, plus one. Okay. Well, let's throw a hammer. Can I reach? I don't think that'll reach. Oh, it will reach. It can go four. We're going to try to hit Mace because he's a cleric. And we don't want him casting. Oh, come on. This is going to be really hard with fighters. Gosh, I kind of want to move back here. I'll probably take a hit. Oh, I can use the wand. Let me do that. Nice. He won't go cast this room. Because I could just see him cast and hold person and wiping out half my party. Okay, we'll try throwing another hammer at him. <clears throat> and these arrows are going to kill me. Nice. Fine composite longbow for the win. Or at least for the mace kill. <laughs> I need to work some of my guys around the back if possible. Hmm. Seven damage. Uh -oh. Oh, oh, that was an orc that went down. Give us a still attacking first, kind of means they got the jump on you. Yeah, they did. Wait, why do these orcs only have five hit points? That's weird. Look at this. So these are orc leaders that have bows, but then these are regular orcs. That also have bows. Same icon, but less hit points. That's strange. A lot easier to take down than I was. Yeah, I was afraid they were all orc leaders. Okay, Trixie, let's not use your wand. Let's switch you back to your bow. Back. I'm going to move you down here.
Okay, this guy I'm gonna move up. And I'll disable bows on all those. Yeah, we don't want to move her forward. points no okay Take down this leader. Awesome. Okay, now let's have you engage a few over here. <laughs> Bose says this game has a lot of orgs. They sure do. Excellent. 191 experience, that's it. Actually, we'll take zero of that, we'll just share. Okay, now some of this is going to be magical. So these are my hammers that I threw. Problem is, I don't have detect magic. There's a mace, so that's probably the magic stuff right here. Let's grab these. And then I'll grab this last one down here. On the dead body of the half orc cleric, you find a piece of paper. Okay, so Durden's going to leave. There we go. So we lost our temporary caster. But I think we're okay to rest now. Yes. 
And then I'll search the rest of the temple for the magic equipment. I think there might be another one, but I don't know that for sure because they attacked me after I opened that last compartment. Okay, let's just do a search. And I know there's something hidden behind the temple too, I think. That's probably it then. Okay, so let's look over here. Destroy it. I didn't search in between the aisles, I guess I could do that. And these, let's walk into the walls. Cody says, after a bit of effort, I did find an open source gold box engine. Seems to be a small development community. Yeah, that's typical, isn't it? So it has been active of recently. I'll drop the link in Discord in case anyone wants to check it out, Cody says. Just want to make sure I don't leave something. I don't think we get a reward when we complete this. I think your reward is the fact that you cleared it and you get to keep the equipment in there. Let's see if this guy even recognizes that we did it. Oh, he's not even there anymore. You have cleared the area next to the evil temple. Here's your word. Oh, so clearing the area next to the temple gives us a reward. That's cool. I didn't know that. Congratulations. You make, yeah, this is the reward for the temple one. You may keep all the stuff you found. Well, heck yeah, we're keeping it. Books, maps, tomes, etc. I'd like to do that one. Group of Thieves. That one's fun too, the Coval Mansion one. Find the nomads and stop them. Yeah, that one's trickier. You have to actually go out into the overhead view to do that one. Okay, so Trixie, are you ready? No, you're still a little bit shy. Well, let's identify and see if I have enough gold now to buy another fine longbow. Let's identify this stuff. 
1500 so these are all going to be plus ones yeah so we'll sell this stuff hammer i'm going to keep because i i can throw that mace sell morning star i'll keep scimitar will sell spear I don't know if I can throw a spear. I don't think you can up close, but I'm not sure of that. It's two-handed. I'll just sell it. Okay. What else we got? Another plus one mace. Regular chain mail. Cleric scrolls will sell. Short sword plus one. It's all normal. Gabriel says, What was that about a character being shy? Oh. She's shy of 8,001 experience. She's just shy of being able to level up as a fighter. Okay, potions we definitely want to identify her. Nice. Dust of Disappearance, that could come in handy. Why is this Woods Holy Symbol worth 250 That's strange. Sell it. Now, if I remember right, you make a lot more money if you sell these individually. Yeah, look at that. They're 250 each, but if you join them, then suddenly it drops to 25 So there's a bug with that. So you always want to split them. Yeah, shy of the next level is what I meant. <laughs> Sorry, Gabriel. Nice. Those will be useful. Okay, and then Trixie, you have the wand. This is one of Magic Missile, we know. Awesome. We're not selling that. And this, I'm going to identify, because we can use the spells on there as a thief. Cleric scroll will sell. Okay, so let's see how much money we have right now. So we need 5,000 platinum to be able to buy one of those. So let's appraise the gems and jewelry. 1,000 for that. And now we'll do the jewelry. Is that enough? That's enough. Nice. It's going to be so good. So we want the ones with the most strength to use them. So, Dirk, you're going to buy one. Boom. Awesome. And you can give this to Chopper. This just had a regular long bow. Everybody's got a plus one bow now. Okay. And I don't have enough to train. Let me just appraise one here. There we go. That'll be enough. Yep. Can't train yet, but once I get enough experience on Trixie. Sweet. Wow, that's going to be super helpful. So now i got to figure out where to go next. I'd like to do Colville Mansion. I think I remember how to get there. Let's see. 
east maybe no we need to do bay i think east will put us on the overhead map so we'll do north yeah this is cobell mansion i believe through that door there to the on the right side to the north i think is how you get to the graveyard now one problem i'm gonna have is there's going to be a lot of traps in here hopefully trixie being a thief will detect them because i don't have fine traps can't cast that As you enter the room, a thief with a sword comes out of nowhere. He tries to attack the party, but you stop him. We're going to attack him. The more of these, I think, that we can kill first, it'll be a less large battle later on. So we do want to stop the killing when we can. Two experience. We got two experience from that. <laughs> Trixie is for kids, Gabriel says. <laughs> Silly rabbit. Backstabs a member of the party, then disappears through the wall. Dang it, we didn't catch him. I don't know if I can rest here. I don't think I can. Let's try it. Nope. Suddenly attacked by three thieves with slings. <laughs> this will be a lot of uh, running back to rest. I, actually, I might be able to rest outside the walls right here nope that's a bummer what was that garbage about a backstab yeah ouch Party detects a trap. We're going to disarm Trixie. So Trixie, you failed. Come on. Large pile of weapons and shields. They appear to be in good quality and fine good and of fine quality. Search them, leave them, take some. There's probably thieves hiding behind them. Search. We detect a trap. Come on, Trixie, do a better job this time. <laughs> nice. Oh, more equipment. Chainmail. Probably just plus one. That'll be a good time to go back to plan and identify it, and then we'll come back again. Hmm. Do experience probably again. Yep. Might as well just say zero. Zero experience. Yeah, they are making a mockery of us.
Okay, rest. I'll make it daytime. There we go. I think I gave it to Dirk. Yep. Well, that's just regular. It's not even magical. This is, this is a plus one chain mail. Ooh, nice. A plus two shield. That is very useful. Plus one sword, so same with that. So, yeah, this is nice. Let's give that the Juggernaut. Oh, no, I can't. He has a two handed sword plus. Plus one. Give it to Dirk then, or yeah. Nice. Okay, and the winner had something. So this is a plus one Morning Star. Another plus one hammer. Nice. Dagger cell. So. so, Flail does, yeah, 1D. I think it does 1D6. Plus. I can't tell. 1D6 plus 1, maybe? Doesn't seem right. I know the Morning Star has a higher low damage. 2d4 instead of 1d6 or whatever it is. Oh, I have the manual. I can look in there. Yeah, Flail does 2 to 7. A Morning Star does 2 to 8. So Morning Star is slightly better. So the flail. Okay. Give the potion of giant strength to someone that could use it like Wixter. And Trixie has enough experience now. Nice. We can level her up. And do you have anything? I need to see what this is. It says wrong class when I try to ready it, but thieves can normally use magic user scrolls. I wonder if I'll be able to use it in battle by doing the use command. If not, then this is a bug and it's not letting me use it because I'm a fighter slash thief. We'll see. No and no. Okay, she has 30 hit points. Let's see what she ends up with. She got three hit points. Oh, it's so bad. 18 constitution, three hit points. Wow. This party is such a dud. Yeah, you can multi-class if you're elf, half-elf, gnome, dwarf. Humans can't. And let's see, level 5 thief, what do we need? 10,000. So really that's 4,000 because when you get experience and you have two classes, it cuts it in half. All right, let's go back to the mansion. Here we 
doing north. Okay, we explored the right side. Let's go down here. As you enter the room, come out of nowhere and attack. Will you chase? Yeah, I guess. He's got a mohawk. As you enter the room, the two thieves split, one going through the east door, the other going through the south. Which path will you take? Hmm. South. If you're in the room, you're ambushed by some thieves. Bunch of level ones. Oh, there's a level six. Oh, there's a couple level six. None of them have shirts, evidently. Or shoes. Just got backstabbed for 15 damage. Ouch. That was a six level thief. with this fine longbow. Oh yeah, let's see if we can use this. No, it must be ready. I wonder if it's because I have banded mail on. Hold on. Nope. That says wrong class. So if you're a fighter thief, you can't you don't get to use magic user scrolls. That sucks. Wow. down. Sixty three experience. 
Yeah, Gabriel says, so becoming a fighter dumbs you down. It does. Alright, so I don't know if any of this is magical. Probably not. We'll take toward the top and toward the bottom. Find some important looking files. You stuff the files into your journal entries 38 and 51. Nice. On a nearby wall is a slate. Drawn on the slate is a complex maze with the words NW Castle under it. Copy it into your journal. Okay. Protect the trap, disarm. I failed again. She's a lousy thief, isn't she? Wooden cabinet, examine. Suspects a trap. Goes off in your face. Oh boy. It is locked. How will you open it? Pick, break, cast, knock, and you pick. Pick the lock, okay. Wow, that was just 666 experience. It's a uh, satanic wooden cabinet. At least her heart's in the right place, Gabriel says. <laughs> She's trying. Back him. <laughs> oh, this is a six level thief. my dog some treats here okay got him 75 experience that's all you get hey smigo welcome to the stream how are you doing Long sword, maybe it's magical. Crude map. Okay, nice. We found more information that we needed. Sharp blades fall on the party. Okay, well, we didn't take any damage. That's a good thing. Table with four small caskets on top of it. What will you do? Search a casket. Search A. We detect a trap. Come on, Trixie, do your thing. Pick. Pick the lock. Got some gems. Nice. Let's look again. This time we'll do B. Oh, dart shoots out and hits one of the party members. It's locked. 
Hey, nobody took any damage. I guess we'll break it. Can we pick again? Oh, you have already tried to pick this lock. Okay. Uh, we'll have winner break it. It's one jewelry, really? You're doing good. Glad to hear that, Smeagol. Yeah, we're getting a bunch of loot here. Some treats after Trixie failed to work. <laughs> Poor Trixie. She's so inept. Can you pick it? Too complex for poor Trixie. Man, she's useless. Okay, winner. Use your brute strength. More gems. We're getting experience too, which is cool. And hopefully it'll allow us to buy another fine longbows. Or yeah, fine composite longbows. Last one, D. That was a lot of damage. And too complex for her to pick. <laughs> That was a lot of experience. 20 gems. Okay. Let's, let's get out of here and go back. Back him. come back here after we heal because we didn't explore every single spot we have enough to level up we do level five fighters and she does not have enough for level five thief yet Gabriel's all did all four dysfunctional parties. Yeah, this party is very dysfunctional. Okay, let's make it daytime. Let's see what kind of loot we found. Magic user scroll can't use sell, sell. So these are normal. Normal. Wow, that's an expensive cleric scroll. Can't use it. Hand mage scroll. Yeah, we'll definitely have enough. 7,000. What? We'll definitely have enough to buy another fine composite longbow. Stone statuette. It's only 15 gold. That's weird. That's just regular scale armor. Regular long sword. Mm 
Okay. Well, we got a ton of money. We have enough right now to go buy another deposit on Let's see, who has the next highest strength? Juggernaut. Bye. Nice. So I think everyone has at least a plus one bow. Yep. Why am I carrying that? Let's see. Yep, so we'll just sell that duplicate. Okay. And we still have a thousand platinum left. Man, with all these gems and jewelry, actually, I bet I can get even another one. Let's try to appraise here. So 2,900, okay. Take the jewelry, raise. Yeah, we did, we can get another one. Nice. Okay, so Juggernaut, Dirk, and Winner already have one. Nobody else has that high of strength. 17s and 16s, so we'll give one to Trixie. So let's take a look at the difference between this plus one and the fine for her. So Thaco 14, 1d6 plus one. Same, it's the same. So once she gets higher strength, like if I can find gauntlets of ogre strength or something, then she'll be able to take advantage of it. But otherwise, it's basically going to be like a plus one long bow or short bow. Okay. Somebody, let's see. Do you have composite? Yep. And Quickster is yours composite. No, so you'll get the composite one. Okay, we're ready. Let's be trained. I think we can start getting two attacks every other hit now, if I'm not mistaken. I think that ha might happen on level 5 for fighters. Okay, Chopper. Everybody's going to be barely short. Forty-one hit points. Fifty-two. Okay, he got eleven. Can't complain about that. Quickster. Thirty-seven to forty-three. Not the best. Juggernaut. Forty-one to fifty-three. That was a good jump. Dirk. Thirty-two to thirty-eight. Level five fighter with thirty-eight hit points. Sixteen constitution. That's not very good. Okay, and then winner. Forty 
46. Went from 38 to 46 with 18 constitution. That's not good either. Trixie. I think you can level up. Oh, no, you need 10,000. Fight Thief. Okay. Well, at least, like I said, I think we might get a second attack every other round now. Share the money. Okay. Looks good. Finish up this mansion. We'll go to the bay. Go to the north side. Okay, we did a bunch of this. This is where I think I need to start going on this side. Yeah. Tries to attack us, attack him. He just drops, yeah, regular long sword. We don't want that. Let's go here. Detects a trap. Let's avoid it. Since I have a hard time disarming. Oh, bronze candlesticks. Okay. Some other stuff. Silver scarab. Electrum decanter. That's interesting. Here's the cracking of glass. Poisonous gas fills the air. Oh, I guess we save we passed our saving throws. Let's try to pick. Alright, Trixie, you finally did it. Nice. Twelve experience. <laughs> so fifteen hundred silvers were twelve experience. <laughs> That's weird. Large needle shoots out of a hidden compartment, hitting a party member. Break. Okay. Uh, avoid the trap, I think. Because you don't get experience for disarming. Tapestries. Overloaded. Not even winner can pick those up. Wonder how much those are worth. It's interesting because you almost have to have giant strength to pick it up. I wonder if you used the potion of giant strength before you did this. If you could pick these up. Because you can't have them from here. Yeah, he can't pick him up even when he's uh hold on let's see how much these weigh 
That might have dropped enough. Let's find out. Nope. <laughs> yeah, you probably have to have like giant strength. Oh well. Converted to a jail. There are ten young thugs beating an older thief. Okay. Time to save the older thief. reach 20 to find composite longbow. Let's see how far it'll reach. It can go 18. <laughs> That's a long range shot. Junk. Okay. You rushed to help the old thief, but it's too late. Before he dies, he says, the boss has allies everywhere. Take these papers, they may all. He then dies. Well, that's a bummer. Yeah, I think we did the rest of this. Huh. I've already killed all these thieves. Why do we have to do this again? Ooh, backstab, but missed. The level six, one of them. Okay. 
the fleeing. You're stuck in the corner, guys. Oh, wait a minute, did I barrels? Yeah. junk yeah okay let's get out of here this quest should be done we should get a pretty good amount of experience i would assume but it's night time i want the rest Gabriel says, wait, did my messages even go through? The, the last message I saw from you, Gabriel, was, well, I'm all for dysfunctional parties, so. And then it says, wait, did my messages even go through? Gabriel, so it didn't. I guess my connection was acting out. Oh, well, that's a bummer. I had typed power went out. Did I miss what did I miss? Did Trixie do some really badass? No, she didn't. Oh, so your power went out? Oh, that's a bummer. Okay, let's get our get this completed and get our experience. Workspace Council was pleased by the elimination of the thieves in Povell Mansion. Here is your reward. What? 191 experience? That's it? And they don't seem very pleased. <laughs> <laughs> That's not very good. Okay, reward for all that stuff. Find the nomads. Large tribe of kobolds is being recruited by the enemy. That's a very hard mission if I remember right. I think I would get my butt kicked with that one. Okay, let's go sell this junk we found. The reward, there was some money they gave me, but it wasn't much. Okay, so. Electric decanter, it's worth, Electrum decanters were seven gold. Wow. Seven whole gold pieces. Incense is worth zero. Silver mirror. I can actually use that later. What? 7,500 for leather armor? What is this? Wow, leather armor plus four. And a short sword. This is probably a short sword plus two. That, that's good equipment. We'll give that to Trixie. Okay. 
being a fighter thief, that'll be beneficial. One armor class now, and yeah, that's good, Thaco. Okay, what else? You know, somebody, here we go, tapestries. So when they're joined together, you get 2,500. We have them, you get 25. No, 2,500 when they're separate. 250 when they're together, which makes no sense. It's a bug. So we definitely want to sell them <laughs> when they're halved. That's so weird. Okay. So we have. All right. Let's see about level ups. Trixie does have enough now to become a level five thief. So let's get that done. <laughs> My dog been wanting treats, but now she doesn't want it anymore. Okay, Trixie. 33 hit points. Now she is 36. Okay. Nice. Hey, Mr. Spock. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? How's No Caster going? It's going great. It's been challenging, that's for sure. But it's going well. We're level five now. And really, we haven't had any deaths yet. Not a single character has died yet. And why? I guess this stuff is too heavy. Maybe give some of this away. Movement of six, still too heavy. Ah, oh, what's weighing them down? Really doesn't have a whole lot he's carrying. 1,405 encumbrance. Hmm. Movement of six, that's terrible. Still six movement. Wow, 17 strength is terrible. Okay, let's give away the hammer plus one. There we go. Now we got him up to nine movement. Quickster's at three. 16 strength. That's even less. Man, I just can't get above six movement there. He's plenty strong. He's plenty strong. Yeah. Okay. I guess that's about the best we can do with that. Can't spoil those dogs, Gabriel says. Have you had to reload it all yet, Mr. Spock says. I've only reloaded when I knew something bad was going to happen and I tried it anyway. And I think I did that twice, maybe. But besides that, no, I really haven't. Yeah, because the first time I tried to fight the trolls, 
Kill those, no problem. Sokol Keep, all those orcs took them out, no problem. Yeah, I haven't had to reload at all with legit battles. But I'm pretty familiar with the game, so I kind of know where I can press my luck, you know. Cody says, that's literally why quick save exists. <laughs> and uh, Sazdam says, need Iron Man pool radiance. This is pretty much that so far, Sazdam. We'll see if I have to reload at any point. My guess is when it, if and when it happens, it'll be the graveyard. I'll get hit and I'll get my level drained. <laughs> and that'll be when I reload. Because I don't have any clerics to use restoration scrolls. So my level drains would be permanent. <laughs> Quick save so you can try dumb things. Yeah, exactly, Cody. Okay. So I'm thinking I can probably go back now to the towns or the area south of Total Plaza. But I should probably save that for another stream. We're coming up almost on two hours. So let me go ahead and save it and be it for tonight, guys. That was great progress. So uh enjoyed that. I hope you guys enjoyed it too. And I'll see you next time.